What's up guys, Brian here and I'm back again with another awesome video. Today I'm going to share with you guys the fastest way to change your replace background in Photoshop. Let's begin. Okay, the first thing I'd like you guys to know is that this only works on Adobe Photoshop 2020. Any Photoshop below this doesn't have this tool. It's a new tool that came with Photoshop 2020 and subsequent Photoshop should have it in case you are watching it in future. The first thing you have to do is to duplicate the background by clicking Ctrl or Command J. Then open your properties window. If you don't have the properties window, go to windows and click on properties. The properties window will come up. I have mine right here. Scroll to the bottom. You see this new option called remove background. Click on it. It will automatically make selection of the subject and mask it for you. So I'm going to import my background now. This is the background. I'll just drag and drop. This is my background layer. I'll move the whole layer on top of it. And as you can see, it made a really decent selection, but it still missed some part of the hair. So to correct that, I'll just click on this mask icon here. Scroll down to my prop under my properties tab again. Click on select and mask. It will bring up this window. Select this second tool here, refine edge. Just brush around the edge of the hair. I'll do that just around the entire hair. And as you can see, the hair has been selected. The red part is the part that has not been selected and the part that has been selected is the one that you can see right now. I'll click on OK. And as you can see, the hair strands that were not selected have been selected and I've been able to change my background in less than five minutes. So that's it for this video, guys. Hope you learned a new thing. If you did, click on this thumbs up button. If you have any question, drop it down there in the comment section. And if you don't want to miss other awesome videos in the future, click on the subscribe button and ring the bell icon next to it. See you guys in the next one. <laughs>